Good evening, everybody. Let's start things off with a summer tradition. It's the Shrine Golf Tournament. Chuck Canada is a regular at the tournament. Nice chip on the ninth hole, and his team would make the putt. The shot of the day belonged to Debbie Doughty. It's two short bounces on the 10th hole, and go ahead and pick it up. Patty Bowles tries to bounce it in off the hill. Nice effort. Everybody had a good time today. All the money that was raised will go to Shriners Hospital, and that's a good thing. In high school baseball, Ottumwa will host Fairfield tonight. The game was going to be played last Friday, but Mother Nature had other ideas. Ottumwa is 1-4 and four in the year, while Fairfield is 3 up and 1 down. We will have highlights on the late sports. The Albia baseball team is off to a 3-1 and one start. They will hit the road tonight to face Sheridan. We would like to play as well as we can for the conference championship and then get back to the state tournament as we did last year. Could anything have been done to prevent James from cramping up? Dr. Kevin Marbury says no. When you think about heat-related illness, that's sort of a spectrum of things all the way from uh, muscle cramps to heat exhaustion all the way to something very, very severe like heat stroke. Um, to prevent that, I mean, of course, finally, two athletes like that will um, work on staying hydrated.